Baby, they did like this when they made these lashes. It's giving natural thighs and booty for the win. For the win. Uh, 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 uh. Loan me a hundred dollars. You ain't got a hundred dollars. We outside. We outside. Yeah. Y'all haven't even seen this little addition to the bar. Hey y'all, I haven't talked to y'all. Well, I haven't talked to y'all all morning. I did record me making my coffee this morning and I was so excited to do that y'all because we are officially 50% done with the coffee bar. Like, uh, when I say I have just been basking in just gratefulness all morning. So I made my coffee at the co coffee bar First of all, let's go back to the co coffee bar. I'm just, I have been on cloud nine all morning. <laughs> like, to the point where <laughs> I just forgot everything that I was supposed to be doing this morning. But yeah, so I did record some content that you guys more than likely saw at the beginning of this video of me just standing up here making my coffee. I just put this cute little chill, little chill outfit on. You guys have seen this before, but with a different top. This is the Skims top. Um, and then I just got on some Hanes boxers because I have to film for TikTok. So I just wanted, I want the video to give just like chilling around the house. And this is definitely something that I would chill around the house in, except of course I had to put on a bra and you know, a regular shirt to just make it look appropriate, but that's what I'm actually about to do now for the next hour and a half is just record some content for them. But literally all morning, when I tell y'all, I went to Chick-fil-A this morning and I got me some chicken minis. Did y'all know that you can upgrade your um, hash browns to a large? I never knew that, baby. But when she asked me, I said, hell yeah. I was like, matter of fact, I don't even want the orange juice. I don't even want the meal no more. Just upgrade them tots. Them tots be so good at Chick-fil-A. But yeah, so I got me some breakfast this morning. If y'all can't tell, the coffee has already taken over, baby. I don't even know. I don't even know what to do with myself. <laughs> I don't even know what to do with myself right now. I swear, like, ugh. But yeah, so I went to Chick-fil-A and I came back and I recorded some content of me making my first coffee at the coffee bar. It's like 50% done. But when I say, I'm just so happy. I'm so happy, I'm so grateful, and I just, I can't wait till we finish it completely. Because when I record content over there, it's, it's going to be given like, that I'm not even in my house. It's gonna be given that I'm somewhere else, baby. It looks so good. It looks so good. So yeah, I'm about to, y'all, I look thick as in this outfit. Like what is, <laughs> what is going on? I look so good. I look so good in this little outfit and this little get up I got on. Like what? Hello? It's 
Thanksgiving natural thighs and booty for the win. For the win. Uh, 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 uh. But y'all, I really, 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 I need to get rid of this. This right here, I need to get rid of it. That's the only thing I hate about all this weight that I done put on. Baby, you can't pick and choose where the weight is going to go. It's going to go wherever it want to go. So that's the only thing I'm hating about this weight, but I look good. One thing about it, I'm always telling myself I look good because I do. Because I do, okay? Everybody got insecurities. And even if you lay on that table and get stuff done, you still going to have insecurities. So I say to hell with it. But yeah, y'all, I just wanted to check in with y'all, though. Um, I don't know what to do with myself. <laughs> but I was like, let me just check in with them and... Today is a Monday, so I will say this much. I hope you guys have a wonderful, a wonderful week, okay? All right, y'all. We are out of here. I got on these um, express jeans that I was telling y'all about. I got on an Aritzia jacket. I got on this little cashmere hoodie because I just did not feel like dealing with that lace and um i think this little top right here is from target so this is so this is the fit cute and comfortable and then y'all know i'm smelling like a goddess smelling like a goddess walking like a goddess talking like a goddess because she's a goddess Skin on fleek. Y'all, I gotta shave my face because do y'all see all of this hair? It's giving a whole goddamn beard. It's giving a whole goddamn beard. Like, what? But yeah, this is the fit. This is the fit. These are the jeans that I told y'all about. It's one of the things. Oh, y'all, it literally feels so good outside today. I am so happy that I decided to get out of the house. For some reason, I thought that it was cold, probably because it was so cold in my house. Get this fresh air and sunlight. I'm getting some gas right now. First stop is probably going to be, what should the first stop be? Probably Target so I can go ahead and get my um, coffee and get me something to eat. So yeah. Such a beautiful day. Such a beautiful day, y'all. My tank was on E, baby. That tank was on E. Who, what, what, what is she looking at? Y'all, this lady was just looking at me like she like she literally was just parked right next to me. Like just staring at me. I'm like, baby, am I missing something? Am I in danger? I had to roll down the window. She said she thought I was somebody else. That is hilarious, y'all. I'm just sitting here like, I literally had to roll down the window like, can I help you? Like what? That was insane. I was actually scared for a few seconds. I'm a G, so a few seconds, but yeah. Oh my God. Isn't it great? Chris. I know, it's my dream. <laughs> I have goosebumps everywhere. <laughs> this is out of this world.
I actually got a good bit of groceries for a hundred dollars. What that little girl said, can you loan me a hundred dollars? You ain't got a hundred dollars? Or do she say fifty dollars? Um, but yeah. I'm trying to wait and see if the content that I did is going to get approved. But yeah. Y'all, that vacuum, I'm going to show y'all. I got a vacuum and I got a, like, mop. I didn't end up getting the shark that I was telling y'all about. Um, I just got, like, some more little wipes to put on my little Swifter thing. But, um, actually, like, right here. So, this is the kind that I like to get, the Clorox. And it has, like, a coconut scent. I love the way these smell. And this pack was only, like, $5. I don't think I realized that they were that affordable. So, yeah. And it has 12 in here. So, really, that's not a lot. But, when I say these things be so wet. So, you can really clean a lot with these. So, I got that. I also got these three glades from Publix. Because they had these by two get one free. So, this is the sheer vanilla embrace. So, I'm probably going to um switch out my Bath and Body Works ones in here for just the regular glade ones again and um yeah because i got six of these so you close that door yeah okay um so at target i got some more of my favorite 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 body scrub it's called the illuminating hand and body scrub coconut and hibiscus with vitamin e Y'all, this is my absolute favorite body scrub. Like, it's so good. It smells so good. Um, the coconut and vitamin E in it just, oh my God. It moisturizes your body so good. When you get, if you use this in the shower, once you get out, baby, lotion is optional. I mean, I still like to use my lotion, but when I say it's so moisturizing, like, so moisturizing. So, Mm, it smells so good so good and i think this was like um ten dollars so so good 10 out of 10 would definitely recommend as far as body care and then y'all i actually looked up and i found a good bit of coffee mugs today so i found these at target how freaking cute is this one like how cute is this like come on be for real how cute is this with the little heart. See, I like the plain, more plain aesthetic. I don't really like all of the bright colors and stuff like that. I mean, it just depends. Like, it has to be really cute for me to like the bright colors. But I just thought this one was too cute. And it's pretty big. So, I'm so excited to use this. And I got one more. They had a couple more that I liked. But I was like, slow you roll. Slow you roll. And then I just got this big and tall one because y'all, I have turned into a real deal. My, my hair looks so crazy. I have turned into a real deal tea drinker. And I, I say this because I don't even like the little small cups for tea anymore. Like baby, I like a big cup of tea in the morning. I like to hold my cup like this, like. I'm just playing, I use a straw, but still like, I love a big mug and really i just started liking the big mugs because my mom got me a big mug for christmas and i have been in love with it and i like to put two tea bags instead of one so yeah so that's what i got and then also i got this floor lamp i'm probably gonna get my boyfriend to put it together but this is how it looks so pretty so freaking pretty so, honestly, I don't know if I'm going to keep that one over there that um, I got maybe a month ago. I might take it back to Home Goods because one thing about it, I can just get some credit. The tags and everything is still on it. So, I might just return that one, but I feel like this one is going to look so good in here. So good. It's so cute. I cannot wait to get this put together. And I'm probably going to put it like right over here. So that you can kind of like see it in the mirror a little bit. I think this is going to be so cute. 
I really think this is gonna be really, really cute. And it was only $50. It was literally only $50, y'all. So I could put it together. I could definitely put it together, but I think I'm just gonna let my boyfriend do it. I'm pretty sure he can do it way faster than I can, okay? But um, yeah, I just warmed up my leftover Chipotle from yesterday, so I'm about to go fuck it up, okay? I'm about to go fuck it up, because I am starving. Starving, and I need to go ahead and eat it so that I can be hungry by dinner time, because if I'm not, baby, I'm not cooking. So, good morning, y'all. It is the next day. It's about 10.30 in the morning, and I'm just sitting here looking out this window like, why does it have to be raining? I have shit to do. I have shit to do. I need to go to the grocery store. I need to go to Sephora because I have so many skincare makeup products that I need to re-up on. And at this point, it's like five products. And now it's like down to my moisturizer. And baby, I cannot be, like my actual skincare products, I cannot run out of those. My makeup, eh, eh, eh. But my skincare products, I cannot run out of my skincare products. Do y'all see the skin? I mean, it ain't perfect. Don't get me wrong. But do y'all see the skin? I, like, I cannot slip. I cannot fall. I cannot slip. I need my products. And this rain is just really fucking blowing me. I would just go to Ulta, but Ulta, like, I would rather just go ahead and get all the stuff that I need. And Ulta does not carry topicals. Ulta doesn't care. And then y'all know, like, certain locations don't carry a lot of stuff, too. Like, I'm, like, it's certain things. I love staying on the outskirts of Atlanta, y'all. Do not get me wrong. Because it's, like, it's a lot of stuff that Atlanta people have to deal with that we don't have to deal with. Um, staying in the outskirts. Like, all the car theft and stuff like that. Don't get me wrong. All of the same stuff does happen, but it's not like, oh my God, like can't catch a break. I could not imagine that. So I love staying on the outskirts of Atlanta, but sometimes stuff like this gets annoying because why don't we have a full Sephora? Like we have one of those like mini Sephoras in a mall. Like we need a full Sephora. Actually, we need a Sephora and Target. Is it Sephora or is it Ulta? But I know yesterday, y'all, traffic was so good. When I say it took 35 minutes for me to get to Atlanta, 35 minutes for me to come back. I didn't run into traffic until I got to my area. So yesterday, traffic was really, really good. So maybe, but it's raining today, so I doubt traffic is going to be like that. Because I was just about to say, maybe it'll be like that today too. And then I can just skirt to sephora and then y'all i kind of want to like sit down and take myself on a little date because i kind of want a really 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 good salad like one of those salads that you get from a restaurant that's what i kind of want because i had a zaxby salad yesterday and you know it, it just wasn't given and i was just like oh like a real good salad with some real good grilled juicy chicken would be so good that would be so good mm. I can taste it right now. Like right now. Mouth watering right now. But yeah. I guess I'm going to go ahead and get out of the house y'all. So I wanted to show y'all some of the stuff that I got from Ulta yesterday. So I got these two new pair of individual lashes. This one is like super curly. If you can see super curly and then this one is just one thing that i like about these like y'all see like the little short band on it i feel like the little short band helps them last longer so i'm gonna try to do a mix between curly and these i have never used these so i don't even know how this is gonna look what is it gonna be giving i'm actually like a little scared to do the curly ones but we're going to see because I have seen people with these curly lashes and they look pretty good. So we're going to try those out. I did a re-up on my, I'm not even going to try to pronounce that name, but basically my rose water. This rose water is so good to just spray on your face every day, all throughout the day. It really tightens. When I say it tightens your skin so good, baby. If you want a 30 plus club like me, 
this is essential so i definitely had to re-up on this one and i just went ahead and got the big bottle because i use so much of it anyway i also got this little applicator i really got this because i see like the tiktok girls using this to actually like seal their lashes so i want to try it i have been doing like individual lashes like the new method that everybody is doing i have been doing this method for a while now but i have never used this little applicator to seal them so i'm gonna try to do that today and i'm gonna show y'all how they end up turning out after i do my lashes and after i do my makeup um i got this little powder puff because i'm really trying to work on my under eye i told y'all i'm starting to get either bag lines or age lines up under my eyes so i'm working like double time to get rid of these fine lines up under my eyes like i just i cannot deal with it um so yeah i got this little powder puff so that hopefully when i do my makeup it'll all set the right way um i also got some concealer the ulta by my house they just do not have all the right stuff like that was out of a lot of nars concealer it's really annoying so i ended up getting cream brulee cream brulee i ended up getting that one which this is a pretty light shade that's why i just got like the little mini and then i also got a concealer that i have never used from them it's called soft matte complete concealer and it's like a cream like concealer so we're gonna try this this is my first time and i got this one in chestnut which is actually like a more natural looking color so i'm actually really 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 excited to try this one so it comes in like this little dip pot and this is how it looks i used to use a concealer like this a long time ago and it did really well with my makeup so i'm excited to try this out and as you can see it's like a really natural shade if you're looking at my skin tone compared to this it's a really natural shade so i do plan on highlighting up under my eyes with this so i'm really excited and then the cream brulee that i got the shade let's see the shade is like this light so this shade is actually pretty darn light so we're gonna do a mixture of cream brulee and chestnut for my highlight up under my eye clearly this one would be like literally right up under my eye and then this one would be like going into my foundation and my bronzer so yeah and i cannot wait to use this as well okay y'all so i am done with my makeup so let's just dissect the situation okay so starting with the lashes so with the lashes they are way more curly than i thought that they would be and that sounds that literally sounds insane it sounds mental because you could clearly see how curly the lashes were in the pack i was not able to use both packs of lashes i only did the curly ones because it's like the curl on them like you could not possibly mix these with any other lash it's do these or go home go curly or go home i don't know how i feel about these lashes y'all but i showed y'all the little it looks like a tweezer but you use it to you can use it to apply your lashes and you can also use it to seal your lashes so baby these are sealed sealed and delivered these are sealed baby they they literally not going nowhere and i realized that all this time that's why my lashes was not lasting as long because i wasn't sealing them y'all i don't know when these are gonna finally come off but it's gonna be a while but they're so freaking curly like oh my god they are literally so freaking curly like i just i don't know the concealer that i used um i think i'm gonna take it back i don't really like it 
it's not i guess it's not like full coverage concealer so that's probably why i don't like it but i don't like it and i'm probably gonna take it back but this is the finished look y'all so it's not completely bad but these lashes are so curly when i say these lashes are bumped to capacity baby they did like this when they made these lashes they are like so curly like literally so freaking curly it's so crazy i'm hoping when i wake up in the morning that they're not so curly because hear me out when i wear my my usual individual lashes when i wake up in the morning my eyes are like very watery so they're like straight and i hate that because that looks so crazy when your lashes are just like completely just like sticking straight out so i'm hoping since these are like already bumped real good that when I wake up in the morning, like they'll actually like be a little looser. That's what I'm hoping. They don't look like terrible. They don't look terrible, but they just like, I've never, ever, ever in my life worn lashes like this curly. I just, I don't know. It's different, I'll say that much. But the little sealer that I use to seal these lashes, if you have never used a sealer before, you got to try it. Because, baby, these lashes is on here. They ain't going nowhere. And also, I tried to, like, comb them out a little bit. And that actually worked. But I feel like they still end up, like, curling back up. So, I'm hoping that, like I said, by the time I wake up in the morning, they're not as curly. So, yeah. But this is how they turned out. I need to move this light because I'm not seeing how I look. But hey y'all, it is Thursday. Honestly, I'm not too sure about what we're going to do today. But um, I know we're going to go to Crate and Barrel. I know y'all probably tired of me saying every vlog... Oh, we're going to CB2. We're going to Crate and Barrel. Blah, 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 blah. But it is what it is. This is a home decor, home improvement channel. So we're going to be doing a lot of home decor shopping and just home decor content overall. So if that's what y'all want to see, y'all can depend on me. I'm your girl, okay? Because this is my life. I do this anyway. So um, my hands are so ashy. I have to um, switch out my purse. I really love this Balenciaga and they have so many different versions of this purse they even have the little mini shoulder one it's so freaking cute this is like my all-time favorite most favorite bag at the moment like I like the Balenciaga even better than this one but I will say that these are two solid bags okay love both of them down but I'm gonna switch purses to this one today because this one just matches the vibe better so i just have on these shorts these short shorts because y'all the sun is out it feels too good but i did throw on this cardigan because it is still march so it's still gonna be a little breeze but one thing i didn't want to do is go outside and be hot as hell this is the outfit i got these shorts from um ross actually I got this tank top from Walmart. This is a Wolford dupe. So if you have been wanting that viral um, tank top from Wolford, check out Walmart. I have this color and I have black. This is a very inexpensive outfit, honey. And then I have on this cardigan from probably H&M, I believe. I have on my Hermes slippers. And then I just have on some accessories. I have on these diamond hoops that my boyfriend got me for, I don't remember. And then I have on this coach watch that he got me for my birthday a couple years back. So yeah, I just have on a whole bunch of silver accessories. I have on my cross. I actually really, really, really like my makeup today. Crazy enough, I really like my makeup. Um. I used a darker color for my under eye and I like this a lot better. It looks a lot, a lot better. I have been loving a bright under eye, but honestly, sometimes 
sometimes it just be looking a mess so i feel like my makeup today just looks so good and so natural so i'm happy about that <laughs> really happy about that my hair i just wanted it to just be given like big and curly i love my look today y'all i really love this fit that i have on so yeah um today today because i've been running my mouth um today i know we're gonna go to crate and barrel because it's this one specific wine glass that I have been wanting from there for a while and today I'm going to get it. And actually the other day I was on their website just kind of like trying to see like what they had. And there's a couple of things there that I know I want. So I still have all the stuff in my cart and hopefully I can get an associate to like help me find all the things that I found online. So we're definitely gonna do that. I know that I'm going on a solo lunch slash dinner. So I'm taking myself out today. Um, I'm either going to this place called Little Rascal. It is a, it's either a restaurant or a bar that's in a hotel. So um, I'm either going there because they have um, this spicy rigatoni that I really, really love. I make it at home all the time. <laughs> Um, and even the one that I make at home tastes so good. So I'm kind of like so tempted to go there. But honestly, I don't even, I don't know what's really on the agenda for today outside of that. I know I want to take myself to a lunch slash dinner. And I know I want to go to Crate and Barrel. We just vibe in a day. Like I look good. I feel good. I'm in a good mood. Like I'm just, mmm. We outside, we outside, yeah. 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 Tell me what you say, come again If you cannot stay down Then you do not have to pretend Like there is no way out Too much, man. Mm -hmm. I like no, I like what is in it. Is yeah, this? No, it's fine, baby. I promise it's fine. I put it on top of the books right here. No, nah, because it's like the lighting and stuff. It is gonna look right. But we're about to do this crate and barrel unboxing. Finally, this box has literally been sitting in my office for how long? About two weeks. About two weeks. Okay. So. First glass. Basically a bigger one like that. Mm -hmm. Okay. My boyfriend's sitting right here because he's excited about the ones that I bought for him because he said that he wanted more manly glasses and I think I got like three of them so he has been eager for me to open his box and then I got this one I think this is the one that I was going there for I should have got the bigger one though 
Cause I got another one that's bigger than this. Like you that with red wine. And... Yeah, this is a red wine glass. But I did have one that was bigger. It looked huge though, but I probably should have got it. I got these things wrapped good. Okay, this one is this one. This one be my coffee, my own mug. Cute. A little mug. Right. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> How you knew it was yours? To have shape. Because that's what she said. She said square is actually very masculine. Mm -hmm. There you go. That's masculine to you? Mm -hmm. You like it? Yep. Getting up. So my we getting up. We getting up. Mm hmm. Got a big old eye cube and nothing. Know what she was saying. <laughs> okay. Now this is another copy of Oh yeah, I forgot I had got this one. So cute. I don't know if y'all can see like the detail. Cognac in there. On this. But it's so cute. I just like these like neutral colored mugs. So cute. No more mugs. Yeah, not after that. One more, one more minute. Oh yeah, I forgot I had got this. It's like a little espresso mm -hmm. cup. You put the espresso in it. <laughs> oh, a shot of espresso? Yes, yeah, a shot of espresso and then you just... Let me drink out of that. Let me put the pinkies up. Alright, I forgot. I totally forgot about this one. So cute. You've been using that, huh? Okay. There we go. Huh? There we go. There we go. There you we go. like that one? That was dope. You like this yeah. one? Because this was the one that I picked out. I yeah. said to me, this looked masculine and at the same time, this looked like a cognac. Yeah. That's, um, that's the one right there. Now, if it was bigger, it'd be even better. For real? Okay. Okay. I like that. Okay. Oh, my drink I got right now. Here. <laughs> <laughs> I like this. Okay. Yeah, I definitely like this. I thought that one looked masculine. This is, yeah. See, the lady helped me pick out this one. The lady should down. But she I picked, picked out that she one. She should let you do your job. <laughs> okay. I got yeah. two of those. I like these. I think, and I also think that these gonna look good on the bar like as for a display. Mm -hmm. Yeah. These are pretty. I like these. I like them too. Yeah, but I mean, they good. wouldn't be my go-to glass, but. But they look at the look store right now. They nice. For a nice little cocktail. Yeah, I don't need to go to the look stuff. Okay. I do want to get this little book that got like a whole bunch of different um drink recipes from Books a Million. I forgot I had oh okay. I forgot I had got this. I know it's for oh it's for that other little I forgot all about this. This is for a cappuccino. <laughs> This is for a cappuccino. Um, did this go with that? Yeah, no, no, that ain't right. This is an actual mug. Yeah, it looks like it's a little more one of the narrow. Oh, okay. Maybe this is it. Yeah, this is it. Yeah. Or is it? Yeah, it looks like it's going. And this is for a cappuccino. How cute is that? That is too cute. Okay. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Oh yeah, this little bowl. I thought this bowl was so cute. Just like the shape on it. That is so cute. I think this is like a salad bowl. Oh, this is a cereal bowl, but this is so cute. Who the fuck eating cereal out of you? I know, right? I'll put a salad in here. So cute. I'm gonna have you fill over sauce. We are about to add a few more glasses to the um the bar. Yeah. 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 
что? You kind of have to do it like down at an angle like that because it's like, but like, because it's so like restricted over here. I don't know, but what do you think we should put these at? You know, you do it now, okay? Because what do you think? You think these should go on the second one? Because you can reach the second. Yeah, reach one. Hmm, put it down. Tell me where you want it. Put, um, put those on the second. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's cute. I like that. And then what are some other ones? Should those right there? Well, no, because I got my little straws in there. I'm going to have to move them straws. And then maybe because some of these glasses we don't use all the time. Like the main ones that we use, like the coffee glasses and the wine glasses. So like the cocktail glasses, I feel like those can go on the second one. Like those that you just moved. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all those and then take straws out and put straws in. I never really considered like how many glasses we was going to need for this bar. I don't think we, we'll need that many. And then plus we got so many already in our kitchen. Alright y'all, so this is what we ended up doing for the racks. This is what we have so far. And then that little bucket that's up there, we've had that for a while. Like literally when we first moved into this house, it's like a little ice bucket that you put um, wine bottles in. So I think that looks, I think that looks really good up there and I think it like ties in like the color of these glasses as well so yeah this is what we have so far it looks really good really 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 good so nice This is how it looks and then it's so funny because all of these glasses that I got up here are like they're just not it this little part right here is just like it's not like long and sleek like the ones from CB2 I mean they're fine but I just you know like don't these just look so short and stubby now that we got the other ones because the other glasses are just so tall and sleek and these are just man, not look, it. <laughs> and then look, then look at this one. This one just, I mean, it's all right, but the other one is just literally so long and sleek. Literally. It's a difference. Man, ain't nobody talking to you, man. Sound like you would. Ain't nobody talking to you. But, all right, y'all. I know I look different than I have in this whole entire vlog, but I just wanted to show y'all the little unboxing of the Crate and Barrel um, stuff that I bought and just show y'all how the bar. Oh, you know what? I didn't even tell y'all that we had even gotten to this point with the bar. I just kind of like... <laughs> out of nowhere like hey we putting stuff up here but yeah like y'all haven't even seen this little addition to the bar the last thing y'all saw was just this part so yeah so now we actually have the shelves up but there's still more things that we have to do so we're still not even finished so be on the lookout for some more updates but yeah so this is how it's looking at this point. And yeah, 
I will see y'all in the next video.